I'm professional race car driver Gary Clute. I started driving when I was seven years old. Today, I'm on my way to a top secret location where I'm gonna put two teens behind the wheel of a car for the very first time. <laughs> Woo! What could possibly go wrong? Don't... Lap, lap, lap! Oh. Whoa, rip out! Touchdown! Why are you driving like a crazy person? Welcome to my ultimate driving school. It's specifically designed to turn unlicensed teens into ultimate drivers. In basic training, our rookie drivers will receive a crash course from their parents on the rules of the road and proper driving etiquette. Next, it's on to advanced training, where each driver will face a challenge I've devised to push their new driving skills to the limit. When I think they're ready, the unlicensed drivers will move on to the ultimate driving test. There, they need to impress the unrelenting evaluator in order to earn a spot on victory lane as an ultimate driver. Our first team is Michelle and her sister, Simone. I sing, I dance, I act, I also model. You don't even have to ask if I can drive a car, because look, see all that matters. OK. <laughs> yeah. I'm totally nervous, because I don't think she's ready. The fact that Michelle has driven a battery-powered Jeep and now she feels that she's ready to drive a proper vehicle is extremely terrifying. Who cares? You just drive, right? Turn this way, turn that way, <sighs> back. I already got this down. Michelle can't take her mini-mobile out on this course, so which one of my full-sized happening hot rods will she choose? I chose the Blue Badger because it's fast, it's sporty, and it brings out my best qualities. Are you ready? That's my car. Oh, this is good for social media. Stand by it, stand by it. Nice. <laughs> Can't even see over the steering wheel. Oh, it looks so nice. Oh, no. Uh, so you have to make sure you're looking at the back. The you. back of my hair? No, Michelle. Oh, OK. Yeah. Drive. Yeah, D. OK, yeah. OK, you didn't. Oh, easy. Watch it. Stop, stop. <laughs> <laughs> you can't use both feet to drive. Turn the wheel fully. Don't hit the curb. Don't hit the curb. Don't hit the curb. <laughs> Turn the car. OK, I got it, this one. Easy, easy. Stop. Brace. <laughs> Dead end. OK, easy. Stop, stop. Brace. <laughs> OMG. Whoops. <laughs> this lesson has definitely gotten off on the wrong foot, or at least the wrong shoe. Our next team is Connor and his mom, Julie. I'm feeling pretty good about this because I feel like I can do very well. And I'm not very nervous because I don't really get nervous. I think just like he is on the football field, Connor's going to be very aggressive behind the wheel. Will Julie still be Connor's biggest fan when his drive is finished? If I can prove to my mom that I can do this, I think she'll be very proud, and I'll be proud of myself. It's time for Connor to pick a car. The car that I choose to drive is the Dragon. Yeah, I think we're pretty confident about this. He's confident. I'm confident. He's pretty, too. <laughs> wow. Jeez, how do you fit in this? How did you know how to do that? Let's see if Connor's more than just a pretty face. Take your time. I know. You look great. Thanks, Mom. Don't you look cool behind the steering wheel of the car? Good job. Look both ways. So you pull into the lane that's closest. While Connor carefully gets used to being behind the wheel, let's check on Michelle, who's taking a different approach. Out, left. No, easy, stop, stop! Left, left, left! <laughs> Too fast, Michelle, stop, stop! <laughs> Michelle, slow down! Watch your back, stop! Michelle, stop! Why are you driving like a crazy person? <laughs> Michelle, this is not a joke. <laughs> oh, this is way too much. Michelle, stop. This is brutal. Michelle, this is not a joke. This is real life. We don't have time for makeup. Are you kidding me? This is a real car. Where is Gary? We need Gary. Ladies? Gary, I can't deal. I'm so stressed. How do I look, by the way? Good? You look great. But you got to listen to your sister. It's your driving lesson. Thank you. She's been on the road before. Yes. Thank you, Gary. See, this is exactly what I'm talking about. What did Gary just say? Gary said that you need to listen to me. OK, I'll listen in. Fine. Fine. Can I go now? 
Meanwhile, the quarterback is working on his moves in the slalom. You need to get the feel of it before you put speed into it. Good. Good job, Connor. You didn't touch anything that I saw. No, I didn't. Hey, Gary. Hey, Gary. Hey. That was How's wicked, wicked forward. Now we're going to do reverse. Got it? Yeah, I got it. Great flow, man. Woo! Do this one for Gary. Slow down a bit. You're going faster going backwards than you were going forwards. It's a little tougher going backwards. Yeah, a little wide. Where's that last one? Come on. One more. One more. Yeah. <laughs> nice. This kid's a natural. Touchdown. How was that? That was good. Did you enjoy that? Yeah. Now let's see if Michelle's finally starting to listen to her sister. I want you to go forward because you're going to reverse back right into this spot now. Stop. Stop the car. Turn the wheel all the way to the right. Careful. Tell me what to do. You said pull all it, the way. Pull it this way. OK, now all the way to the right, all the way to the right, all the way to the right. Stop, stop. Forward, forward. Stop, 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 stop. Stop, reverse, and pull it back. Reverse, stop, stop. <sighs> I guess you could have came back a little bit. Oh, stop, 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 stop. It's OK. You made it. Look at this stop sign. Michelle, you're going to hit the curb. Whoops. Coming up, we'll see how Michelle and Connor handle my advanced training. Oh! Stop, stop, break. Oh. OMG. Yeah. <laughs> nice. These two rookie drivers have completed their first ever lessons behind the wheel. Michelle, slow down. Good. Good job, Connor. But soon, they'll need to impress the evaluator in the ultimate driving test. First, they'll need some advanced training. So far, Michelle has been very focused on her looks. Hey, oh, how do I look? Michelle, seriously, you changed? Yeah. Ladies? Yeah. Your lesson's over. Now it's time for some training before the ultimate driving test. I noticed in your lesson that you were definitely using the vanity mirror mm -hmm. more than the rear view mirror. Yep. So mm -hmm. this challenge, it's going to make you use the right mirrors because it's parking. Oh, parking. Oh, parking. Let's see how well you do with that. OK. Just because you can drive a car doesn't mean you can park one. And to make it even tougher, there's more than one way to park. We're going to challenge our drivers to either back in or pull in in a designated amount of time. OK, so you're going to park three times in three minutes. You've got no time for touch-ups. Hear that? No time for touch-ups. Mm -hmm. Three, two, one. Go. Go, go, go. Slowly, slowly, slowly. Turn, OK? You're going to go into that spot up there. Forward a little bit more. Stop, stop. OK, now put the car in reverse. Oh, hold on. Stop, stop. Michelle, I said stop. Listen. Forward. Turn the car this way, up there. OK, stop. OK. Now, wait, wait, wait. OK, keep going. Easy. Remember, we only have three minutes. Easy. Yep, easy. Slowly, straighten up, straighten up. Okay, put the car in park. Woo! High five. All right. Let's That's one. Two more to go. Again, to the right. Forget this stop sign. Oh, no. Michelle, you're going to hit the curb. Whoops. You're going to park forward. Forward. In. Now? Oh, this spot. Yes, the now. Oh. Oh. Whoa. This is terrifying. This is brutal. Come on, car. I think this one's good, right? OK, park. All right, that's two. Last one. OK, OK, and stop, stop. OK, now we're going to reverse in. Watch your side a little, a little bit. A little bit like this. Just a little bit. Like, Easy, because you might hit that car there. Stop, stop. Go forward, just a touch. OK, stop. Yep, bring it back into reverse. Turn the wheel fully. OK, easy. OK, stop. You're going to go forward a little bit, just to straighten up. OK, stop. Perfect. Now bring it all the way to the right. Stop. OK, stop. Careful. Care, stop, stop. Oops. Uh... OK. OK. Careful. OK, straighten up, straighten up, straighten up your wheel. Straighten up. Straighten, straighten. All right, put the car in park. Whoa. Woo! All right, that's three. You're done. High five. You did it. You know what? Without hitting those cars, you would have had a perfect run. You, you did that? three minutes and 27 seconds. Wow. It's pretty darn close. Wow, good job. I think you're ready for the ultimate driving test. I'll see you there. Oh.
And you did it in those heels. Yep. Now it's back to Connor, who did well in his lesson, but he and Mom Julie kept things pretty slow. Don't you look cool behind the, the steering wheel of the car? Look at me. Yeah, I thought I did pretty well other than a tiny scratch. But... All right, team. Oh. Lesson's over. Now it's time for some training before the ultimate driving test. Your lesson, you did great through the slalom forward and backward flawless. Now let's see if you can get up to speed and be consistent. So for you, your challenge is speed sense. All right, let's do this. Every driver dreads the radar trap. In this challenge, they're gonna have to go a specific speed that I designate. I want them to be able to look at their speedometer, but keep their eyes on the road for safety. All right, here's what I want you to do. Get up to 43 and hold it for at least three seconds. I'll meet you at the other end. Is there a cruise control? No. Okay. <laughs> all right, guys. Three, two, one, go. All right, all right, all right. You're at 20. Coming up 30. Come on, 40. Hold it, come on. Keep going, a little more. 40, 45. Okay, hold it. All right. Got up to 43 for two seconds, but then you went up to 46. You got to be consistent. Do it again. All right, all right. Three, two, one, go. Okay, here we are. We're 20. Go, 30, go, 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 go. 40. 45. 45. Hold, 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 hold. 43. You're there, you're there. You're doing it. Okay, good. All right, man, you nailed it. Yeah! You did it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> You're ready for the ultimate driving test. All right, well, that's good to hear. Are you sure you're ready for the ultimate driving test? I'm 100% sure I'm ready for the ultimate driving test. Careful, careful, stop, stop. Hey. Oops. The lessons are over and advanced training is done. Yeah. For Michelle and Connor, it's time for the ultimate driving test. If they can impress the evaluator, they'll earn a spot on Victory Lane as one of my ultimate drivers. But look out, because taking her place in the passenger seat is none other than the evaluator. The evaluator's here, but where's Michelle? I'm so sorry. Oh, such an inconvenience, I know. Hi, guys. Oh. Michelle, what took you so long? I changed my outfit and my makeup. Do you like it? Oh, are you oh, serious? Hi. Nice of you to show up. Are you always late? Kind of, yeah. Okay. At least I look good. Michelle needs to concentrate and stay focused to keep control of her vehicle. So I've devised three challenges that will help her do exactly that. First up for Michelle is the slalom. In this challenge, drivers will have to zigzag around the obstacles just like downhill skiing. She'll need to stay on course and she'll need to do it while maintaining a speed of 40. Let's go. Come on, let's hit the road. That's 20. I'm going up. You gotta pick it up faster. You gotta go faster. Easy, easy, easy. Whoa, easy, easy. Push out. <laughs> and you're at 20. Okay, you're supposed to be at 40. Okay, okay. <sighs> On to your next challenge, please. Now it's Connor's turn to meet the evaluator. Hi, Connor. Hi. I'm going to be your evaluator today. Julie. Hello. Nice to meet you. Go, go, go. Connor needs to let his confidence come through and trust his instincts. If he can do that on these challenges, he'll score big points with the evaluator. His first challenge, swerve and protect. Driving is anything but routine. You've got to be aware of your surroundings and be prepared for those sudden surprises. A quick swerve here and a quick swerve there will go a long way in protecting you and your passengers. Let's do it. Oh, uh-oh. I wouldn't go forward. I would go backwards. All right, there's an idea. Uh, stop. All right. Uh oh. It's okay, Connor. You can do it. Just concentrate. Focus. Remember, use your gas if you need to. Good job. Okay, Connor, on to the next challenge, please. It's back to Michelle, whose second challenge is slope parking. In order to succeed, she'll need to parallel park her car between two vehicles parked on a gravel slope. 
She'll need to demonstrate her speed and brake control in this one. Let's go. There's no time limit, so this challenge will test her patience and concentration. No need to go crazy. OK. OK. Turn your wheel fully, fully, fully. All right, Michelle, you know what? Go forward and line up beside this car here, beside you. Like so. OK, stop. Stop. OK, now turn the wheel all the way to the right, reverse. OK, now left, left. Now left, now left, now left, now left. Keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. All the way back down. This thing is not moving. Oh, just a little bit. OK. Just forward. Yes, forward. Turn the wheel fully to the left. Did you? It's fully to the left. You know what? <laughs> This car is stuck. She's going to need a tow. Yeah. If Michelle's challenge was to dig the deepest hole, she would have passed with flying colors. Uh, at least we managed to pull the car out. On to your next challenge, please. OK, Connor, the next task is all about spatial awareness. All right. Connor's second challenge is the snake. In this challenge, our rookie drivers will need to maneuver through the course with laser precision. To be successful, they'll have to be fully aware of all of their surroundings. Oh, and Connor only has two minutes. All right, just go slow and steady. Well done. Just look ahead of you. Turn it a little bit more. What do you see? Watch that bin. Oh, watch the wrong bin. Look ahead, Connor. That's it. You're doing a good job. Nice. Oh, man. All right, whatever. That's in the past. Tight. Too hard. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Nice. You gotta take it wide. My boy, Connor, what are you thinking about? All right, we're almost there. I can see the finish. <laughs> You want to stop before you hit those things. <laughs> then stop here. Yeah. All right. Car park. Good job, Connor. Good job. Hit a couple things, but I did very well, I feel. On to the next challenge. Coming up, can Michelle redeem herself in the graveyard of cars? Other way, Michelle. This is more than three. I'm disappointed in myself. I can see the finish. Connor made a few mistakes, but managed you know. to complete his second challenge. Now it's over to Michelle and her final challenge, the three-point turn. To succeed, she'll need to enter the graveyard of cars, execute a three-point turn, and exit all within 60 seconds. Other way, Michelle. It's OK, just turn the vehicle. OK. Reverse, turn the wheel all the way. Yep, keep coming, keep coming, keep coming. Stop, stop. Gary's saying to go. Keep coming, keep coming, keep coming, keep coming, stop. OK. Forward all the way. Stop. <sighs> Woo. Throw it, throw this is it. more than three and disappointed in myself. <laughs> Back it up one more time and you'll be good. You haven't hit anything yet. Reverse, reverse. OK, stop. Drive. Woo! <laughs> All right. She got it. Yeah. Woo! Nice yeah. work, Michelle. High five, girlfriend. All right. Hey, okay. high five. <laughs> All right, yeah. Michelle scored a rare high five from the evaluator. Mm -hmm. But has she done enough to pass? OK, okay Michelle, I'll give your results to Gary. Come on over. All right. <laughs> So, I think today was probably more runway than highway. I know. Yeah. OK, Michelle, take it easy. <laughs> take it easy. Anyways. It's time for the results of the ultimate driving test. Michelle, driver. you were too slow on the slalom course and failed. And you literally dug a hole for yourself in slope parking and didn't finish the challenge. But you did manage to impress the evaluator with your three-point turn. Hey, yeah. I'm sorry, but you failed. Oh. Oh, jeez.
You know what didn't fail me? These looks. Even though I failed, I proved to myself that I could drive. It's back to the kitty car for you. Oh, jeez. Got to follow your sis home. I have to say that I am proud of Michelle. All right, Michelle, peace out. Towards the end, she really pulled herself together and tried to focus as much as possible. Simone, wait up! Wait for me! You did a great job. High five. Connor's final challenge is one he's familiar with. This time, he'll need to reach 45, maintain it for three seconds, then hit the brakes before hitting the wall. OK, Connor, let's go. Come on, Connor. Come on, Connor. More speed. Start. At it. Yes. At it. Four, 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 four. Yes. Come on, give her, boy. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Get give faster. Break. <laughs> Perfect. Ah, nice work. <laughs> well done. Did it. Well done. I'll give your results to Gary. All right. Come on over, guys. How you doing? Good. Good. So, Connor, That's you right. were so fearless in tackling all of the challenges. And now, it's time for the results of the ultimate driving test. Connor, you lost your focus and control oh. in Swerve and Protect, oh. but you regained your composure and recovered nicely in the snake. Finally, you impressed everyone with an all-star performance in Speed Sense. You passed. Yeah. Yeah. All nice right. work. I passed. Yeah. <laughs> Connor, you've earned a spot on Victory Lane. You're an ultimate driver. Give him the keys. And as an added bonus, you get to take Mom's car for a victory lap around the course. We did it. I am pumped. Yeah, we did it. <laughs> Way to go, Connor. If there's one thing that I could tell kids that want to drive, is put the pedal to the metal. Yeah! <laughs>